You are watching Yay or Nay Reviews, where we take two minutes to answer one question. Should you see it? Bright Night is the 2011 remake of the 80s film by the same name. Starring Colin Farrell and Anton Yelkin, the story revolves around Charlie, a young teenager who discovers that his next door neighbor, Jerry, is a vampire who is intent on sucking the population of Las Vegas dry, quite literally. You'd think that we've seen enough vampire movies, but obviously not, as once again we find ourselves being seduced by another vampire romp. Being a remake, Fright Night is hardly original. This time it shadows itself as a cross between 30 Days of Night, Disturbia, and Legion. And only one of those movies was any good. Vampire rules are important in vampire movies, but here, rules come out of thin air. As an example, a Vincent Price spoof of a character hands Charlie a weapon and indicates this was blessed by Saint Michael. Kill the vampire with this, and all of his victim's curses will be reversed. Where did this come from? It was a deus ex machina moment that really didn't fit in the film. That said, I didn't hate the movie. It isn't a good horror movie, but it's a decent farce. It's a comedy. The biggest failure is that it's being marketed as a horror movie. Once I realized that it wasn't, I really actually started to enjoy the movie. Sure, it has no content. It's a filler popcorn flick that you'd only want to see once on a big screen with your friends, but it's not pitifully horrible either. Horror movie? Nay. Comedy? Skipping the 3D, of course. Yay! Tell us what you think. Leave us a comment below or come and talk to us on our website, shouldyouseeit.com. Then, join us over on Facebook where we post exclusive outtakes from the reviews.